Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Talicia Burton and this is Fortified Roses. Today we are going to be setting up my planner for October 26th to November 1st. So we're going to be using my catch-all planner per usual by Planning to Prosper along with my, well not my, but her sweet Halloween sticker kit that I purchased. <laughs> so it's now it's mine. <laughs> um, we're just going to lay down my date dots first and then we're going to lay down my washi. Um, I did kind of want to do this with a voiceover only because I was very much trying to experiment with this kit in the sense of really trying to figure out how I wanted to lay things. Um, typically I'm trying to, I don't know typically what I'm trying to do, but <laughs> I haven't had any like complete consistency in laying down my planner. So now I'm really trying to find like a consistency because honestly when I watch Stephanie does hers, it's, it's a pretty good consistency of what she likes to do. The stickers just change and maybe certain little things change depending on if there's events or something special happening. Um, but for the mo most part, it's very much consistency when she's digital planning. Um, even when people lay down planner stickers, it's still like kind of consistency. And I've never had that consistency planning at all. So I am really trying to get that level of planning and that level of consistency um, now. So that's pretty much what you're seeing me do is figure out how I truly want to lay down my stickers the actual hours because I was thinking of buying her hourly which I still might buy for next year but I'll probably do that more in December um and yeah so I'm trying to like really like kind of lay down the hours um of how I want my hours to go because if you have her digital planner if you watch my digital plan you kind of know at this point there's way more than 24 lines here to represent 24 hours in a day. So, with that being said, I am typically sleep by midnight, hopefully. If I'm not, I'm just typically laying in my bed. It's kind of rare that I'm doing something or have something planned earlier than 5 and later than 11. I like, it's rare. So that's why I put 5 to 11 because I feel like that's kind of a good slot for me to work with. And then again, I can always adjust that because her plan is more 24 lines. <laughs> so um, that's just kind of where I'm going with here. Um, so I'm just laying down some washi. Now I have her sweet Halloween kit, but I, don't not, I do not celebrate Halloween. Um, that's personal preference. Everyone to each its own. Um, but I just, I personally don't celebrate Halloween. Um, um, but with that being said, the kit is still cute. It's still cute. So I decided to use, like, more of the cat eye glasses, um, because I do have, um, blue light glasses. Finding out there's different strengths, and I'm realizing I don't think mine is nowhere near this, a strong enough strength. So I'm like, oh, that was little cute money wasted, but they're cute glasses to wear. So, um... I'm just um, gonna lay down those washies along with lay down quite a few stuff. Um, I'm gonna be real, but do not feel like talking this whole video. Will I talk this whole video? Probably, maybe, hopefully not. <laughs> um, but um, I did just kind of want to get in here and you know do the voiceover so it's not just music and talking. I am realizing though as I'm like watching this video while I'm doing this voiceover that I did not lay my stickers correct on both sides. Or maybe I did. Actually, I don't know. They don't look correct as I'm looking at it but then again, I don't know. <laughs> um, but I am... I, that's just pretty much what I'm doing, you guys. I'm sorry. I am just trying to figure out this planner situation, what I'm doing, and how I want it to be done. For the most part, my weeks are typically the same. Um, I do want to have a goal of having a, a more functional type of schedule um, to where I can, I can, um, how do I, I don't know how to put noise. I can... Gosh, Talisha, which words that child? I don't know. <laughs> um, 
have a more functional week where I can have time for the schooling I need to do, the studying I need to do. There we go. Um, the time I need to spend with the teen girls during ministry, the time I need for detailing, the time I need for myself, the time I need uh, to take care of home, the time I need to just spend time with family or, you know, just really having out those designated times um much better and not feeling overwhelmed um sorry i'm quite tired um i am uh, just tired <laughs> um but yeah so that's just kind of um the gist of what i'm trying to do along with um as you will see i updated my school hours in a sense of from it being 7 to 11 to 7 to 2 I did that because my actual time for school will be 7 a.m. to 7.30, 7 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. I wish it was to 7.30 a.m. That would be great. <laughs> um, but I'm doing that because of that. Um, and because technically my school will be, if I was lived on the East Coast, it would be from 10 a.m. to 5.30 p.m., which would be great because I wouldn't have to get up so early. But because I live on the West Coast and my school is on the East Coast, I have to be in class at 7 a.m. Um, I will be starting school on November 16th. I think in past videos I have specified that I will start school October 26th, which was the goal. That was the goal. But because of earlier this month, I wasn't able to get my prep course completed in time. I have to have it done at least two weeks before... The next session starts and because i didn't get to get that done in time um and now we'll start november 16th um so technically i have until this monday coming up um so november 2nd to um complete my um prep course should have been completed by now absolutely it's definitely been about a good month and a half <laughs> at this point definitely should be done with this um, but my goal is to do that, to complete it, and to not stress over it. So, yeah. <laughs> um, mm, that's really it. Um, yeah. Sorry. Just thinking of something. Um, but, guys, I'm so tired. I know part of the reason I'm tired it is because I have not been eating well the last day and a half. <laughs> so like yesterday and then pretty much just morning. Um, so that's kind of why I'm not feeling well. And then I had milk and I shouldn't technically have the dairy, at least not a lot of it. So that's the whole thing as well. Um, but, but... Um, I'm just going to keep pushing through this, push through the sleepiness, I drink a ton of water, and hopefully clear my system, <laughs> and just do this. Um, a YouTuber I watch named Kelly's Corner, yes, yeah, Kelly, well, Kelly's Corner, yeah, okay, she was, uh, I was watching her video this morning, actually, and she was talking about, um, a Skillshare motivational person she listens to. I don't know if they're motivational, but they were talking about, some, about motivation. Um, I, well, I don't mean this. <laughs> they probably sounded bad. I don't mean to say they're not motivational, but I don't think the goal was, like, I don't think their goal was to, like, be a motivational speaker. Um, I, but they talk about, obviously, skillful stuff, right? Useful stuff. Um, but the topic that this particular person was talking about was motivation. And, um, um she was sharing that um motivation isn't um it, it's a, it's a mindset it's a mindset in a sense that we have kind of conformed our minds our minds become conformed to think that we have to feel motivated um versus just getting up and doing what we need to do and we will find the motivation as we do it and realize it's not that daunting of a task and i am <laughs> totally understanding that more as I'm sitting here doing it with the mindset of understanding like you just have to kind of get up and do it which I've low-key always had the mindset of thinking like oh I just gotta get up and do it and that'll be fine um but 
I can definitely get very tired, very uh, very sleepy like now because of my autoimmune disease and then the way I eat, so it like affects my body even more. So um, that is just like kind of a thing. And um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Um, but I am quite grateful, I'm going to say, in the sense of coming across that this morning so that I can, like, really get to the mindset of doing this. Um, you would think as you're talking, you wouldn't be as sleepy, but I'm sleepier because I'm legit talking and that, that's, it's baffling right now. Like, how, how? But, yeah. <laughs> um, so just wanted to share that um but how is everyone doing probably should have said this earlier <laughs> i hope you guys are planning with me i hope you guys are well i hope you guys are planning with me um <laughs> along with whether it's digital or paper planning um let me know which one you like better i do like digital planning better um i have found it to be um, in a sense, a lot more helpful for me. I do have physical planners like my EC Daily Duo and my EC Life Planner, <laughs> along with my EC Deluxe Planner, which I was using as a budget planner, but now I have my digital budget planner. Um, so there's that. But um, I do, and I have like two A5 planners a spiritual one, or a church one, slash spiritual, and then like just an A5 planner. It's kind of a mix of everything. Not a mix of it's kind of a mix. Um, but my digital planner is probably the one I am in the most, <laughs> to be honest with you. Um, I have yet to use my catch-all planner to its full potential. I have yet to. Um, so hopefully I will eventually use it to its full potential. Um, and yeah. <laughs> so here's the goal. Um, I have been enjoying the screen recording. Um because I just low key kind of feel like it's easier to edit. I don't have to worry about lighting. I don't have to worry about making sure I'm angled correctly. If I'm getting everything in the, in the frame. Uh, because everything's literally on the screen already. So I've actually quite enjoyed it. I did get this idea um, from Stephanie. Who owns Playing to Prosper. Um, because she had did that. Um, and it was like, oh. I like that duh we can do that i got a whole iphone <laughs> um but then so i got the ipad so it makes it pretty easy too so there's that so i have been enjoying that i feel like also it's just easier to edit as well um so yeah yeah <laughs> um so i'm just gonna kind of let you guys watch the rest of this and i will come back at the end
Okay, so I'm back with the end of this video. I hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Please leave comments below. Um, let me know what you think of what I'm doing. And I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye!